So this guy posted an ad on Craigslist offering to help write job application cover letters and improve resumes. I wanted to see if he'd help me write a reference letter and pretend to be a fake previous employer of mine to help me get a very prestigious job. Well, let's see if we can get your boy Tyrone to bluff his way into Google. But I definitely ain't qualified. Hello? Uh, yeah, hi there. Uh, I, I was just reaching out regarding the Craigslist advertisement for the, uh, the references. Okay, so what kind of letter of, of uh, recommendation is it? I'm, uh, I'm applying to uh, the Atlanta Dental Center. And, you know, they need like five, six years experience of uh, being a dental hygienist and stuff like that. Do you charge extra to kind of like, you know, I embellishing a, a resume a little bit? Like just to kind of you know, beef it up a little bit, something like that? Right. Well, it, that's up to you. Whatever information you give me, I, I can write it down. I can make it look good. Because the thing is, like, I don't have any experience with dental hygiene aside from brushing my own teeth, but I, I do clean them pretty well. Like, I got a whole mouth of pearly whites, so it it'd be great if you could just, like, pretend to be a dentist that I was employed by. I can't do that, sir. I can't I can't pretend to be a dentist. But, but I, what's so how, how do you plan on getting a job as a dental hygienist? Because they have to go to school for that. Uh, I've operated a pressure washer before. I, I used to work for, like, a, a, a decking company. So, I mean, like, it's all about, like, you know, just getting through the, the crevices, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm good about getting in those tight spots. Well, I, I would recommend that you become a dental hygienist if, if you haven't gone to uh, to school for it. Why don't you go to school for it? Yeah, because ain't nobody got time for that, dog. I'm, I'm trying to make this paper soon. Like, I'm just trying to expedite the program, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, because like, I wouldn't want somebody working on my grill if they, if they didn't go to school. Like, how about this? $5,000, if you can just be Dr. Schwartz, I'll get you a burner phone from T-Mobile. Uh, you can just, I'll, I'll put that down as your phone number. All you got to do is record a voicemail. Be like, hey there, my name is Dr. Schwartz. Thank you for calling the Atlantis Dent Dentistry Center. Hey, why don't you do it? You sound pretty good. <laughs> I, I know, man, but like, but, 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 but when they call me for the interview, man, I'm going I'm to sound the same, you feel me? Like, I'm going to sound the same. Like, you sound like a nice, wholesome, clean-cut dude, man. Hey, man, you should be a comedian. <laughs> Yo, man, I, I'm being you this serious, be a comedian, bro. Like, man. Oh, my God. He hung up. I mean, honestly, towards the... <laughs> Hello? Yeah, hi. May I please speak with Troy? This is him. Yeah, hey there. This is Russell Schwartz. I'm calling from the dental clinic. Uh, I'm just giving you guys a shout back regarding a reference letter that we received. It's for a Tyrone Biggums. Um, it looks like... He's... No. <laughs> no, no, I, I didn't do I didn't sign it. I'm gotcha. sorry. It said that he worked for you for five years as a dental assistant in your facility. Um, is there a chance that that rings a bell at all? No, no, I told him not to say that. I, I no. But you do know a Tyrone Biggums, is that, is that correct? And he, he did, he's, he did... I met him, but... I met him, but I, I, I don't want to talk about it. I, I, I... It says his skills with the water pick were, quote, off the heezy. Sir, y yeah. sir, I have nothing to do with it. I, I have nothing to say. I, I have nothing you. to do with it. Well, should we hire this individual? Because aside I, from I, that... I, I've got to go. Dr. Troy, be there? Oh, my God, dude. He fucking go. That's such a funny concept. Hello? Hey, what's up, Troy? Uh, how you doing, my brother? All right. What's up, man? Yo, I'm real confused, man. Like, I, I just got a call back from the dental clinic. They told me that they tried to call you and you threw me under the bus. Yeah, and, and I did. Yes, I did, because I told you I wouldn't do it. No, but I thought you just wouldn't write it, but I thought you would, you know, do me a solid or something like that. Like, no, it, I, it, I can't do that. I was, can't do that, sir. It, it was all, you were like... I, I can't, I gotta man. go. You was no, like one I yes away, that. man. That's, like, f from one brother to another, man. Like, you said you were vouching me, dog. I, I know you, my brother, but it's unethical. I can't do that. Damn, man. Like, I, I I'm a professional. I can't do I know, that. I almost got hired. All you had to say was yes. I gotta go, man. I'm busy. I gotta go. Can I have him call you back? Can I have him call you back just one last time? Please, brother, do me a solid, man. Like, I need this jar. Oh, my God, dude. Troy, in his mind, he's like, who? What kind of f***ing crazy person? Hello? Yeah, hi there. May I please speak with Master Troy, please? This is him. I'm calling from the law offices of Punji and Abdu Associates. Uh, we have one of your previous employees who applied for a job here, uh, stated that he worked for you for five years and helped you succeed in about 90% of your cases. What's his name? Uh, it's uh, Mr. Tyrone Biggums. No, I, I, I don't know him. Well, he, he said you're one of the most qualified lawyers in the area. Is that is that bogus? or Because we were, we were heavily considering this candidate for the job, so I'm just trying to figure out and, and take some That's notes. It's, it's, uh, it's bogus, yes. I, I'm not a lawyer. 
Got you. But but you are Master Troy PhD. Is that you? No, he's up to no good. So so we shouldn't hire him. Is, is what ultimately what you're saying? It's one. Of... But if you want to hire him, that's mm-hmm. up to you. Mm-hmm. Okay, but could you go ahead and just give me a verbal okay to, to vouch for his character and I can just take it down here? It would make our lives a bunch easier if I could just... Sir, sir, I, I've talked to you enough. If, if you can't figure it out, uh, then you don't deserve the, the job that you have. Uh, hello? Destroy... <laughs> 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 I love that I was able to use the same voice, call him as Russell again. I wonder how many times I could call him from like different offices and be like, Hey, uh Hey, this is so and so from Punjit Building Group. Wanted to hire him as the lead architect. <laughs> uh yeah, hello, can I speak with Mr. Troy please? This is him. Uh, yeah, hello, sir. How are you doing? Uh, my name is Panjit Kumar. I'm calling from the Human Resources Department here at Google. Yes. Uh, yeah, I was just following up regarding a glowing recommendation letter you sent over here for Mr. Tyrone Bigums. Uh, we're looking to hire a new... I d- uh, sir, sir. Uh, yeah. Sir, I did not... I did not send any letter for Tyrone Bigums. I'm looking at it right here. He's applying to be a uh, software, a lead software engineer here at uh, the office for Google. <laughs> um, uh, well, well <laughs> sir, <laughs> this is funny. I'm sorry for laughing, but I did not. You, you have to hear me. I did not send any letter of recommendation for him. Okay, but but this is this okay, is I'm, this is Troy, CEO of KMS Technology, right? You're the president of a tech company. Okay, do do you, I did not send the letter. We were just so excited because it said that he could reroute the MD5 hash through the OC3 optical line in under 10 seconds, and we thought that was impossible. So that's why I'm so confused. But hey, well, maybe maybe you can do it. Maybe you should hire him then. Do, do you know this guy? But I didn't send the letter. Do you know this guy? No, no. Well, I know him. I met him on the phone, but that's it. I've never met him in person. Okay, yeah, because he's actually in the other room right now. We just finished the interview. I told him I would step away to make a phone call, so I, I'm just so confused as to why he would do that. Uh, I, I can go ask him. Uh, well, tell him, tell him that you just talked to me, and I said I didn't send the... Yeah, I am Troy. Yeah, I know him, and I did not send the letter. Hey, 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 boss, uh, this is Tyrone. Uh, I was just calling uh, to... Uh, they, they was just calling about the reference, you know, about how we used to... <laughs> Uh, oh God! Uh, hey, m- m- hey, Tyrone, you take care of yourself, hey, hey, man. M- 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 Mister, come on, my brother. You, I mean, like, you just tell him about that one time I rewired the MD5 hash and, and how good I did. Uh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I was so close to that Google job, fam. I heard they got great perks too. I seriously wonder if he ever googled the name Tyrone Biggums and saw all the ridiculous Dave Chappelle skit references. If you enjoyed the concept, drop a like on this video below. You can always request a prank of your own on my website, and I'll see you subscribers again next week.